I was on a, upon a podcast the other day when, and they asked me like, who are you? And it just kind of like hit me in my, in like, it just hit my brain. Like at that exact moment, I was like, I'm just an ordinary person trying to do extraordinary things just by doing the extra. And it's just work. Like at the end of the day, we're always told about the stories of winning and, and it, because we're not told the backstory of any of those things, we're not told about the 20 years that actor put into perfecting his craft or the 20 years that business person put into building the structure underneath them that allowed him to gain success. We assume that it's it really is quick and easy because we're not told those things. Wouldn't it be really cool if you could ask people, what's the extra on the ordinary? That's... And, and, and because it's like most people will say, well, ordinarily, right? Hmm. Ordinarily, this is what we do. But what if you said extraordinarily, this is what we do? And I talk about extraordinary, that word, all the time because when you break it down, it's just ordinary. And that's just simple. It's right. the regular. It's the things that anybody can do. But the magic in that word is the extra part, which just means you're doing more of the regular, ordinary stuff than everybody else. So it's not that you have to go out and invent some new way of doing something. It's not that you have to... You know, be the first one that ever sold this type of product in this particular way or found this niche that you're all of a sudden crushing. Like that for me was the greatest encouragement because I was like, I'm not really anything special, but I'll work really, really hard. Uh, and from the very beginning, that was kind of like my, my deal. Like my close ratio was super low in the beginning, but I worked so ridiculously hard. I would come back at the end of the week and and my now business partners, but at the time bosses, they, they would ask me, they're like, hey, how many life insurance policies did you sell this week? I'd be like, 120. I'm like, booyah. And they'd be like, well, how many people did you see? And I'm like, 500. <laughs> and they're like, that sucks. <laughs> and I'm like, I'm like, what? I sold more than everybody. And I, that was just my whole thing. I was like, I'll figure this you know, training, and I'll learn the stuff down the road like as I go, but I'm just, if my close ratios 20% and yours is 90, I'm just gonna go see five times more people than you are and beat you every single day. And um, that was just kind of like the way I rolled. And then obviously now over time that has gotten way better. Um, so we're able to be a little bit more uh, efficient. But at the end of the day, like people ask me all the time, they're like, well, how do you sell so many life insurance policies? Just to give you an idea, so you guys know how many life insurance policies people sell. I sold 2,300 life insurance policies last year by myself, one-on-one, -on -one, face to face sold over over 7500 in the last three years face to face one on one by myself um three weeks ago three or four weeks ago i sold 182 or 187 in in uh, four days um, but people are like oh how'd you do that and i'm like well i don't know get on my facebook live when cena jumped on there at 12 15 in the morning my time it was like 9 15 here but i was i think it was on instagram live and i'm walking out of a meeting it was 12 15 in the morning and i just sold 15 policies to a group of people they're like, well, that's, that's how, that's why. I'm like, you just work when other people aren't, like doing the things that other people don't want to do.